Nowadays, we're starting to see drones with these follow me features. And then there are also some that claim to have foldable designs. Now, what if I tell you that this drone I'm looking at right here has both features and I can grab hold of it anytime I want? Just like this. This is the Hover Camera. It's the first of the many upcoming products from a Beijing startup called Zero Zero Robotics. When folded, it's about the size of a VHS cassette tape. Once you open it up, you see that it's driven by four propellers, which are apparently developed in-house. The main camera here lets you take 30 megapixel stills as well as 4K video. There's also a downward facing 3 megapixel camera and a sonar underneath to help stabilize the drone itself. A single charge will last about 8 minutes. After that, you can easily swap out the battery, just like this. And in case you haven't noticed, the biggest selling point here is the fact that all of the propellers are enclosed within a strong carbon fiber frame. The Hover camera doesn't come with a controller. It's all done with your fingers and a couple of virtual buttons in the mobile app, as long as you're connected to the drone's Wi-Fi hotspot, of course. To enable face or body tracking, simply toggle video recording mode and start recording once you see a bracket locked onto you. The tracking worked well for when I walked around either indoor or outdoor, but once I started running, it struggled to catch up. The video is also a bit buggy at the moment, so there's obviously still work in progress. Speaking of which, in addition to the 360 panel mode, Zero Zero will also be adding cool features like gesture control and orbiting mode, though there's no word on when these will be available. Now, according to Zero Zero Robotics, there is no price announced just yet, but they are aiming for somewhere below 600 US dollars, which is pretty impressive given its capabilities and what it's made out of. And they also said that this hover camera may be coming to the markets during the summer. So stay tuned for more news.